Do you know that you could have butt acne? Today we will learn about where they come from and what we can do about them. I'm Nurse Wong and this is Butt Talk. Butt acne is not the same as facial acne and must be treated differently. There are two types of buddy acne. Number one, folliculitis. Folliculitis is inflammation of hair follicles, which can look like small red bumps or white-headed pimples around a follicle. It's typically caused by skin organisms like Staphylococcus aureus bacteria, yeast, or fungi. If left untreated, folliculitis infections can become boils. Boils are large red pimples that can cause severe discomfort from the inflammation. Number two, keratosis pilaris. Keratosis pilaris are small, scaly, rough, red-colored bumps on your butt teeth. They have the resemblance of strawberry skin texture. They typically occur when buildup of keratin, which is skin protein, blocks your butt pores. Generally, these conditions come and go, so don't panic. Now that we know about butt acne, let's talk about how to treat it. First, stop scratching and rubbing your buddy. By rubbing, scratching, and popping your butt pimples, you introduce more bacteria from your nails. You're just making the problem worse. You can leave your buddy with scars. Number two, practice and wash your buddy daily, especially after a workout or when you've been sweating profusely. This keeps the area clean. Great ways to washing your buddy are using antimicrobial soaps with cleaning formula that includes salicylic acid, lactic acid, and urea. Be sure to rinse off well before drying. Soaking your butt in a warm bathtub instead of just taking a shower can really open up your pores. Like using a sitz bath, that's a good solution. Lastly, gentle exfoliation with a clean microfiber washcloth can minimize bacteria buildup, leaving your buddy clean and shiny. Just be careful not to over scrub your buddy since this could lead to more irritation and pat dry afterwards. Number three, wear loose and breathable clothing. Bacteria love dark and sweaty warm places. Tight fitting clothes prevent your butt pores from breathing. They also rub your skin causing irritation. A simple solution is to wear loose fitting clothes made with breathable cotton fabrics. These clothes can cause less friction to your buddy. Watch your other videos where I recommend my top 5 butt acne remedies. Please like and subscribe to Butt Talks TV. It really helps our channel grow. If your acne still gives you a bumpy buddy after following these recommendations, consult with a dermatologist or a colorectal doctor for further guidance. If you like our video, press the like button below. Comment on what you would like to learn about next. For more tips and tricks from Butt Talks, subscribe to our channel. Have a great poop day!